You can see them too? Hell, of course I see them. Come on, we gotta move. Why? <laughs> because that's the way the story goes. Yeah, but let's move. Whose story, you ask? Oh, I've got a gun. Just keep that light steady on him. It took a moment, but then I recognized him. He'd been on the ferry when I first arrived here with Alice. He knew my name. We were headed in the direction of Lover's Peak. There was no way this was a coincidence. He was the kidnapper. Come on, Wake. You better keep up. Hear that? It's them. Back. I have a player. You bastard. You had to do that. Hey, open it, will you? Back! Back, I say! Help me! Mike, give me some health there, buddy! from the emergency box to hold them off while I get these boards off. Give me the gun. Yeah, <laughs> no kidding. Give me the gun. Are you kidding? Give me the gun. Really? No time for back talk. Pull them off, damn it. Oh, crap. Hold back to take it. Here, I'll put it right here. Oh, you feel better now, Wade. All cozy and safe. Shut it. I don't have a gun. Better get ready. They'll be on us soon. Can I have a gun, sir? Ooh, thermos. I would have missed that. If I wasn't paying attention. This is it, Wake. The last stand. There's more players here. Get ready. We fight them as long as they keep coming. Give me oh. the goddamn gun. They're coming. That's not how this goes. This fire a mile.
You say that, but then more come. I'm out of flares. Buddy, get rid of him. A ball. Thank you. I dodged that. Hi. Where's my wife? I knew you were going to say that. I read it all before. You're a hell of a writer. Congratulations. You're gonna bring about something glorious and terrible once we get you some uh, proper editorial control. What? What the hell are Where's, you talking about? What are you talking about? Where's Alice? I want the entire manuscript, or she's gonna suffer bad. You touch Why? Yeah, I mean, like, what? Is he a writer as well? Is he jealous? Hey, get back here! Where's my girl? You're gonna give me the manuscript or you'll be sorry! No! Come back here! I swear I'll kill you if you hurt Alice! Do you hear me? Come back here! He had Alice. And he wanted the manuscript because he thought it held some magical power. But I had no manuscript to give him. I had to get back to Barry and figure out my next move. Speaking of a manuscript, we got a page. Paging Mr. Wake. Paging Mr. Wake. Alice's fear of the dark. On more than one occasion, Alice had tried to explain to me how it felt to be afraid of the dark. To her, darkness wasn't simply the absence of light. But something more tangible than that. It was something you could touch and feel. Worse than that, it was something with a mind of its own. Something malicious and malign. For her, things changed when they were wrapped in darkness. They turned into something else. Something foreign. And nothing was safe or innocent anymore. I'd never really understood what she meant. Until now. And it seems like we're already halfway through. Well, except one manuscript that's only obtainable in Nightmare Mode. So, I don't know, maybe I should do Nightmare Mode for fun. I mean, what do you guys think? Should I do an, an extra playthrough for Nightmare Mode? I mean, I'm sure a lot of you will enjoy the suffering and all the, the anguish, maybe. I don't know, probably not. I mean, I've experienced plenty of times, so sometimes that's annoying. I mean, if it the if the viewer wants it, I went mine. Uh, he'll wait. That that guy over there. What's over here? But I wouldn't mind, though I think I've seen it that it is tough. Huh? Hold on a bit. That's a bear trap. I mean, okay, well how come the game would just let it shine like that, and I can't shoot it to dismantle, to disarm it, though? Hello? Yep, that's a bear trap. 
And look at all these bear traps. What? No. It's just bear traps everywhere. I mean, hey, I got some stuff. Oop. Got another uh, pyramid down. Did I? Wait a minute. Did I go through the whole thing? You know what, just in case. Like, this feels big enough to hide, like, another thing, like a thermos. It just kind of seems like if I don't hit, step on bear traps. Uh, no. Take it will come out, I guess. It does seem like that's it. Oh wait, look, we're back at the start. Kinda cool. Absolutely not. You know, I kind of wonder, like, in Nightmare Difficulty, I wouldn't be able to see that sp the little light spark. Like, if that were the case. Actually, I did shoot them both in the head, so yeah, if I did hit them in the head, they do extra damage. Shows me, I guess. What, what was that? What was that? Oh yeah, no shotgun shells after that, uh... Where the... That guy was wanted. Alright. Oh, come on, really? Nothing? It 
something would have been up here. Nothing. No one else. <laughs> Wee! I even do like it how some of their bodies would just fly up after getting shot. Well, then again, they're. Eh, what would you call it? They're taken. They're. They're creations of the dark, or something like that. to do all that again, don't I? Where's that gonna send me? I know I've hit a checkpoint. Where's it gonna send me? All this part. Uh... What the? Oh my god. I touched. I had a lot of barrage. I should have put out a flare. But a flare's... I only have one. So of course it's already settled there, it's done. So it's just gonna move on. was pretty close. I look like that bow was ready to rev up and charge at me. 
I bet that it'll do a lot of damage. Thermos. Coffee. And a manuscript. Wick, here's a chainsaw. The night that chainsaw. In one desperate situation after another. I was exhausted, and my body felt as though it had been chewed up and spat out. The flashlight was heavy in my hand, and each pull of the trigger sent a painful shock up my arm. But I was finally out of the woods, and things were looking up. That's when I heard the chainsaw. Am I going to be fighting Dr. Salvador out here? Oh dear. That would be fun. A hunting rifle. Well, what do we have here? You know, if we're facing Dr. Salvador, I better keep this in hold. Save the ammo for, you know, that guy. Hey, Chris, I got a flare in case. I had heard the plane fall. It made no sense. It was clear that it had just fallen here, but it was very old and obviously hadn't flown in decades. Looking at it sent a shiver down my spine. I forgot about that, actually. Oh, of course. <laughs> I don't know if it's really necessary to do so, but I figured why not. That was a spark. Hmm. Oh, come on, you could have grabbed that. There's the chest. <gasps> Man, I'll take a whole bunch of flare guns. And again, if we're taking up on Dr. Salvador, I'll have the flare guns ready. Along with the hunting rifle. Excuse me. Ah, uh, let's just take the death. I thought I dodged that. Come on. I pressed the thing like crazy.
course, but if you show up... And insert a battery to make it fast. Go. Ooh, checkpoints. Did you see a manuscript right there? No. Looked like one I saw. Okay then. Reach the top of the bill. Haven't found anything else. But again, if I miss it, I'm not worried about it too much. I should not have gotten hit there. I call BS. What the f Oh. That hurts me for real? Oh. Well. Well, if you say so. I mean, for the record, it is Darkest Blights or something. So I guess it just makes sense that it does hurt me. Oh, page. Oh yeah, I think I did miss one. Oh well. Deputies at the logging site. The logging site was a mess. The modular office had been pushed off the cliff. Deputy Thornton climbed up from the wreckage, excited, breathing hard from the exertion. Nobody there. It's weird. Don't you think that's weird? Bored, Mulligan let out a mighty snort. Hell, it's always weird, Thornton. Just a question of sorting out what kind of weird it is this time around. One, two, three, four, five, six. Minus one, which is only in night nightmare mode, we're missing five. Oh. I also did see the manuscript. Barry and Elderwood. When Barry saw the darkness attack the visitor center, it made him a believer. The men Al said he'd shot, they hadn't been just locals on crank. Somehow the world had changed, like the channel had been switched without warning. 
You think you're watching a sitcom, and you're really watching a horror show. When the birds started attacking the cabin, Barry wasn't surprised, just terrified. Just surprised. You know what they say, seeing is believing. Thermos. Coffee. Damn good cup of coffee. Trophy, by the way. I don't say I could go for some coffee right now. I mean, it's now 6.30 in the morning, so I guess it wouldn't hurt to get some. Those count for collectibles? No, not at all. And yeah, it's getting one quarter done of the uh, thermos. Thermos. Darkness wears her face. I guess it's time to put out the hunting rifle. Wow, two shots of the hunting rifle, and one of them landed on its head. Wow, that's good stuff. And see, always a good thing to have these in favor. I'll take a refill of it, why not? I done deserve it. Ah, there's a... Manuscript. Wake feels the dark presence. Shadow stirred and the wind picked up as I ran through the forest. I felt the dark presence turning its gaze toward me. Then the moonlight was blotted out by dark shadows that raced violently across the ground, moving too swiftly to be natural. Darkness gathered between the trees and melted again to reveal the taken. No natural path had brought them here. They were led. I just like to keep the revolver on, in case I gotta deal with more of the small fry. Unless, I get the flare to help. Haven't ran to Dr. Salvador yet, though. I mean, again, you would think that the manuscripts are... foreshadowing. Like, specific enemies and whatnot. I say they know there's another one
Well, hunting rifle is strong. Look at that. Keep hold of shotguns and hunting rifles for the big brutes. I mean, the flare gun can also be an option. Totally up to you. Oh! Thank you. Weird, yes, but I like to keep them in check. We go in the campgrounds. Oh, there's Salvador. That use of the flare gun. Die. What do we learn, kids? Use the flare guns in this sort of situation. Super. Cause uh. <laughs> I can imagine if that chainsaw wielder hits me, that would I would instantly die. <laughs> like, come on. Those who play first evil four knows. Well, and five. I don't remember. Yeah, six had a chainsaw wielder. It was a indestructible boss. You know, even as I say this in sense, I do enjoy the remake a lot because if it's it goes back to the normal horror roots. Even though I also... It's hard to choose which one's the best. I like the original because it's the first Resident Evil that I have played. And I've even owned and beaten. I was under 18. I was like 16 or 17 when I got it. And it got me into it. And I love it. I still love it today as well. As the remake goes, I love it. So it's hard to choose which is the best. Hello? Ow, the porch is covered with birds. They've got all Hitchcock on me. What? Stay out of sight. I'm on my way. Don't open the door. Am I crazy? Stay hidden. I'll be there soon. Just make sure you keep the lights on. They hate the light. So, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if they do, do go to the route of having to do a Resident Evil 5 remake. But honestly, i like to see Code Veronica get remade before 5. Just saying. I still and, you know... To reach Barry at the cab, but at least I was out of the woods. You say that. No! I'm out of... I cannot carry anymore. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. But yeah, again, I kind of want to see Code Verona kick every make before 5. I mean, I'm down to both. Just saying, I'm down to both. Garage keys. A story is not a machine that does what you tell it. A story is a beast with a life of its own. You can create it, shape it, but as the story grows, it starts wanting things of its own. Change one thing and you set off a chain reaction of events that spreads through the whole thing. The characters have to be true to themselves. The events need to follow a logic that fits the story. A single flaw and the magic is gone. 
the story dies, Alice dies. Huh. Yeah, and see these right. What the fuck? Sorry, dude. I did not know you were in here. I did not know you were taking the dump. Oh, a manuscript page. I didn't see that. Nightingale fires at Wake. The FBI agent's command froze me in place. I considered surrender. It was all falling apart anyway. I could give in, let someone else deal with it. But it felt all wrong. Cold instinct. His posture. The way he held the gun. He was no friend. Shots ringing in my ears. I leaped for the hole in the fence and stumbled into the darkness beyond. Hey, you know. If they also go to the route of having to make a Resident Evil 6 remake, which, uh, even I don't know about that, Chief. I hope they get it right. Yeah, I mean, yeah, 6 was the black sheep of the family. I mean, it had its pretty bad reputations. Ooh, that's a rifle. But, it had some okay moments, but not too many good moments, okay? It, it had some weird moments, like... Freaking Simmons turning him into a giant Tyrannosaurus Rex! Come on! You serious? That's just weird. Into the vehicle. Alright. Oh wait, I forgot you could drive! Not too big a fan of this, though. Eh, yeah, so let's just drive through. <laughs> Come on, turn around. Hi there! Get in! I have to wonder, do you, do you lose automatically if the car is broken down? I would be surprised if that's the case. Hang on, I see something over there. Ah, there's a chest somewhere.
Okay, I'll be back. <gasps> oh, you mother... You get to hit twice. That's not fair. Come on! No, oh, fuck off! I tried to dodge, you bastard! Ah, oh, damn it! I should have stayed in the truck. Aha, uh -huh, man, all the way back. Right, um, right, right, of okay. wait. Oh, wait, I think that shack is where. Holy crap, why are there so many of you guys? There's so many of them. Watch y'all just piss off for a bit. There it is. Now you're just pissing me off like that. Oh boy! Honestly, I'm not sure if I'm gonna miss a lot. Get back in the car! You fool!
Oh, so I should just keep going. Hmm. All right, detour. Not chasing me, which is good. Got a thermos. Wait a freaking! Oh God! Oh no 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 no! Run 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 run! How about a hunting rifle? Honestly, give or take, this might be the final stretch throughout this, uh, this chapter. I need to get back to my car. Come on, Wake. You really are acting like Harry Mason. Be like James Sutherland. At least Sutherland had a marathon, man. Ah, uh, the car is busted. Uh, huh. Can I drive in other cars? No. Well, I'm not far, thankfully. here the flare gun was probably the best weapon I could imagine against the dark things I was facing might be the case Sure is a hell of a lot useful right now. So maybe we're just coming back. Come on, really? It's not that high. I could jump that. Just, you know, shimmy out through it. Jump over. Oh, checkpoint. Oh, hey, Barry. The kidnapper. You oh, no, it's that guy. Where's my wife? Enough horseplay, wake. You deliver the manuscript, and you can have your woman back. Simple as that. I don't... Listen. Listen. I'm gonna need time to finish it. I still need to write the ending. I need... a week. Not done? I need a week. Two days. The old Bright Falls coal mine is nearby. You can find it easy, city boy. The main building, there at noon. You bring the manuscript, you get your wife. Not, well, get me. Yes, yes, I, I get you. You know, weren't you here on vacation, and then some weirdo decided to come in and was like, I need your manuscript. For what purpose? Barry had talked about birds over the phone. Pick up all these flares. I'm gonna need them. Uh, open the door, please.
What a dope! Throw a flare at a murder of crows. Oh, that's it? Okay. Hey, Al. I'm... I'm sorry for thinking you were having a psychotic episode, man. Don't worry about it. We're done I with that, aren't we? I sent to the town to ask around about a man fitting the kidnapper's description. He'd go through the archives of the local paper. Perhaps he could learn something. Anything about the island and the cabin that had disappeared. The man wanted a manuscript. I had to try to write him one to get Alice back. For me, the supernatural had always been nothing but a metaphor for the human psyche. A tool to use in writing fiction. Now, it was happening for real. And I couldn't put a single word on paper. Plus writer's block. Sucks having those, huh? Wheeler speaking. This is Rose. Rose? I found Mr. Wake's pages. Oh, you sweet, brilliant girl. Could you and oh. Mr. Wake come get them? I live in the trailer park outside the town. We'll be there in less than an hour. See you soon. Have a great day. Yeah, she's possessed. Hope you come back soon. Welcome, Welcome to, to the old dear Good girl. Uh, it's her. It was the entity. Or rather, they call it the Dark Presence. I mean, it makes sense. You know, is it just me or is that, was it just that one old lady hey, who's from Persona 4 if she was turned evil? You know, the same old woman who was mourning from her husband. And she always walks around with a morning gown. Death Arcana too. The social link. <sighs> you know... I think Death would one day want to stream Persona 3 and 4 just for the nostalgia. At least before uh, Persona 3 Reload comes out. Of course, honestly... I look forward to that, because that new voice cast is actually pretty good. You ask why do I keep this up? I mean, it's episodic, you know. That just fits. And in later news, Disney Plus is looking to, you know, remove some more shows. I mean, we always have to blame Bob Iger because he's a greedy son of a bitch, you know? I mean, not paying his writers and his actors, like, come on. 
It's not hard to pay your workers fairly. Come the frick on. That's probably what's charged. Oh, that actually is a good fix. 